I have no idea what I'm doing. Not a clue. This is an all-terrain vehicle carburetor. Yamaha! 450 four-wheel drive Kodiak. And we were having trouble with fuel going out of the carburetor drain hose which it is designed to do so that it doesn't flood and generally when that's happening the needle valve inside is worn out here is the needle valve the needle comes out. That tip is neoprene and eventually it wears out after many years and the brass fitting has a o-ring around it and it just pulls in and out. Since we got a repair kit We decided instead of only replacing the needle valve, we would replace the jets and a few other things. Apparently, I did it incorrectly. See these two pieces right there? They sure do look identical, don't they? But, one is a pilot air jet, and the other is... I have no idea. Jet main is not. Pilot screw set it might be. I have no idea. But these two nearly identical. They have holes going all the way through. That hole is larger than that hole. I didn't know that when I put the carburetor back together. It's a bigger hole than that one. So the idle is now not running correctly. And I'm thinking when I put the carburetor back together, I put these two little pieces in the wrong place. Had this carburetor on and off and on and off and on and off several times trying to figure out what the problem is. Take these four out, the bottom cover, I'll make sure that the drain plug screw is tightened, and we'll take a look at those jets. I don't know what the numbers are meant 17.5 for one, and 70 for another and I have no idea but it doesn't seem to be thousands of an inch it doesn't seem to be thousands of millimeter either. okay this is the main jet this is the pilot jet and the main jet has a real small hole and the pilot has a larger hole well, I'm thinking I accidentally swapped them, so I'm going to change them, put the big one on the main, put the smaller one on the pilot, and we'll see what happens. that should go in there. I don't know what this is. There was one in the rebuild kit, so... Put that in there. Screw it in all the way, and then back it off two and a half turns. Apparently, 
that idle speed is telling me that the jet pilot screw needs pilot air jet needs about a quarter of a turn inward. I've settled on a pilot jet screw um, turned in all the way and then backed off half a turn which is a whole lot less than what the manual suggests. It ran great. Never do that. <laughs>